Hi everyone, it's Annie. I'm here in North Carolina where I've been studying with Robert Tennyson Stevens for the past 20 days. Today was our last day and I'm making this video just to keep you posted on my experience and what I've been learning. There's so much that I desire to share with you. And I'll start with just saying a few things about our unconscious mind and our conscious mind. When they are aligned with our heart's highest desires, that's when we can experience, that's when we can create the experiences that we really desire. And so being able to decode our words and use new words can help to shape our consciousness and our energy so that we can be more truthfully and powerfully aligned with our, with our hearts. What I learned here, some of what I learned here, was how to decode language and body language as well as what can be seen in the irises to be able to see what has been in the subconscious mind to be able to bring awareness to what's been our word patterns have been and then recognize what is being resurrected what makes this work so beautiful is that once we can recognize what is what is present we can have power over it by loving it applying love to any situation organically upgrades it so for example I'm feeling some fear about how I'm coming across right now. And I'm breathing and I'm feeling it and I'm sitting with it. And I'm loving, I'm loving my fear. What fear indicates is the re restoration of courage. It's courage returning. And yes, <laughs> my fear has dissipated a lot. <laughs> so it's our last day and I'm going to spend the rest of the week in Asheville exploring the city. The city of Asheville is one of the best cities I've ever visited, even though I've only had a little taste. Where I've been staying in this beautiful retreat center is about 45 minutes outside of Asheville. So, oh, and also my parents are coming up to visit with me. They're driving up from Florida. It'll take them about seven hours to drive up to Flo from Florida to Asheville. And we're going to spend some time together. And then I'm going to drive down with them and I'll fly back to LA directly from Orlando. And this was a spur of the moment change of plans that I had, uh, that I made last week. There have been a lot of changes of plans that have been happening in these past 20 days um, that I see for myself and for everyone in my life. I, all I can say, <laughs> is that dreams are possible and they are still there they are in all of our hearts and we can we can live our dreams okay until next time bye bye